What's up everyone? Tonight I am in my kitchen and I am making broccoli. It's like a it's like a broccoli salad. And um, I, I make it all the time, but I've never showed you guys. So I got the bag half cut up and I thought, I should be filming this, what's wrong with me? Anyways, I get these from Walmart. I think it's like 250, maybe 260. Um, broccoli and um, I buy this, um, it's Marie's, see it's mine. It's Marie's cold slaw dressing. Um, it's really good, I think this is like $3. Um, so we got two fifty and three dollars. That's like five fifty. Um, and then I take some cheese, like some mozzarella cheese or um, cheddar cheese, whichever one that I have in my fridge. I don't really go out of my way and buy a bag of it just for this because I don't even use the whole bag. And um, I mix a little bit of sugar with with um, the dressing, and um, I chop the broccoli up. I cut the ends off of it and I chop it up. And that's that's what I was standing here doing when I thought I should I should be filming this because you guys have never seen this I've never made this for you guys and it's delicious. Let me tell you, it um, what does it cost like three four five fifty and then some cheese so maybe six seven fifty. Um, everybody has sugar. Um, I like I said I don't buy the bag of cheese so probably you know like seven bucks to make it. It's, it might seem a little high, but if it's just for you and your partner, I mean, you could, I would say it's at least four decent servings. It might be more than four servings. It depends on how much you want. And like I said, I cut the ends off of them. Like, let me find one. Some of them don't even have no ends on them, but I still take and sliver that sliver the end off of it and then just cut it in half. And I'll show you guys, I'll put you down below. Okay, so I have it here in the sink. I don't know what you're seeing. There we go. Um, I have it here, and I just keep grabbing pieces of broccoli, and I cut them in half. Because these pieces, some of these pieces, if you look, some of these pieces are really big. So I cut all the ends off into the trash can. And you could keep the ends if you wanted to keep the ends, but I don't, I never keep them. Okay, so... My SD card fell up this time. I have a lot of videos I have to get edited so I can take, so I can remove them off my SD card. Anyways, I'm still cutting up the broccoli and um, it is so good. So, you know, if you like broccoli salad, you could probably put carrots in it too if you wanted to. You could put pretty much anything. If you wanted to do cauliflower, I bet it would be good with cauliflower too. Um, it would probably be really good with cauliflower. You could do broccoli and cauliflower with this dressing. Um, I was trying to find an alternate dressing that wasn't, you know, three bucks for this little teeny thing. But, um, you know, that's not really not a bad price anyways. Sometimes you can, sometimes the generic stuff, like from, say from Save-A-Lot, Sometimes the generic dressing is good. Like the Italian generic from Save-A-Lot is really good. And it's it's like $1.50. Um, but sometimes, it's, you know, the generic stuff is really gross. So I guess it just depends on your taste or what you like. Um, but I chop it up pretty small. Not real small. You can see. It's just, it's, it's just crumbs. Not too small, but it's so good. Oh my gosh. I wouldn't leave it like this. This is too big. You want it to where you can just get a bowl of it and, and really um, get a good piece in your mouth without choking you. But I want you to let me know in the comments or come back to this video and let me know if you, if any of you try this because if you like broccoli and um, coleslaw dressing, oh my, 
I'm sure it's going to be delicious for you. Um, I almost bought, and I didn't, I almost, because I figured I'd screw it up. I almost bought the, the blue cheese dip dressing like this, and I was going to try it, but I thought, you know, I don't know. Tyler doesn't always like the blue cheese, or maybe he won't, and I kind of didn't want to waste, kind of didn't want to waste $7, um, and then have us not like it. I like blue cheese. I probably would have liked it. And if you just tone it down with a little bit of sugar, it won't be so tarty. And that's what I do with this. I um, put some sugar in there and it takes away the tang, you know, the tart. And this is good in the summer or winter. In the summertime when you just want something light and you just want to snack on something. This is delicious. It's good any time of the day, though, or any time of the year. I'm just thinking of, like, something light for the summer. It's really good. And, um, it's optional if you want to cut, if you want to cut the, um, if you want to cut it up. I always cut it up. So it made, you know, a good bit. Okay, I hope that wasn't blurry the whole time. I guess if it was, I'll trash the video and make it again another time. Um, I'm going to set you guys up on the counter, and we are going to finish it up. I was in the process of making, making myself a salad for dinner. Okay, so here's the broccoli. I use this whole jar, but first I put some um, sugar in it. And usually I just put the sugar in the broccoli and then mix it up. Mm. I got no muscle, guys. I got no muscle. All right. So there it is. Oops. And I got it everywhere. That looked like there was... Hold up. Okay. So I'm just going to dump it all on the top. I use every bit of it, like I told you guys before. These jars used to be glass. And they used to be so nice to, to um, you know, to keep, to store stuff in. Now they make them plastic. I mean, they're still nice to store stuff in. But... They were nicer when they were glass. I don't know why they started making them plastic. Okay. So then I got a little sugar scoop. Well, it ain't little. It's, um, let's see, it's one third of a scoop. But I'm not going to do one third of a scoop. I'm probably going to do half of that one third of a scoop. Probably like half of it. And I'm just going to, oh, probably not even that. Just do it to your taste. I'm not even going to do that. So it was maybe a, a a third of the third scoop. All right, so there it is there. And um, I'm going to mix some cheese. Let's see what kind I'm going to mix tonight. I have pepper jack cheese, but I don't think I'm going to use that. I think I'm going to use mozzarella. I think I'm just going to use some mozzarella cheese. And just put as much cheese in it as you want. You don't even have to put the cheese if you don't want to. I think the cheese makes it good. So I put, um, you know, not half of the bag. I put about a third of the bag of cheese. Now, if you wanted to, you could put pieces of carrots in there. You could put other stuff in there. Um, at the moment, I don't have any of that stuff, so... I'm going to mix it up. And then you just stir it up. I usually put it in a, in a bowl with a lid and I shake it. But 
we'll just stir it up and then it's so good it's delicious I bought myself some wooden spoons because I was deep frying and I melted the white spoons I guess I wasn't supposed to use that that kind of spoon or probably not this one either in the deep fryer but um, yeah I melted them into the grease so I had to throw the grease away I was like I was like talking to somebody with this in the, in the grease with the deep fryer guys and all of a sudden I lifted up and I didn't have a handle it was gone yeah I'm sure that was real healthy okay and that's it there it is who wants a taste it is delicious ready get it um let me know if you get this and try it now if the if the sauce is too spicy you can try different sauces but if the sauce is too spicy, add your sugar. And then if, you know, if you didn't add enough sugar, you know for the next time. But it's good no matter what. It's really good. I have terrible lighting in this house. Or for filming anyways. Um, Alright, so I'm going to try it out. I know it's going to be good. Tyler's going to be so happy I made it. Here we go. I know I love it. Come on, get my piece out of there. All right, here we go, guys. Mm. I need stirred a little bit more. But other than that, it's delicious. It's really good. Okay, so let me know if you ladies and gentlemen try this. I love you guys, and I will see you soon. Hi, guys. Peace. guys so we are here at Cracker Barrel and we are meeting Juanita and the road we had to turn on from the GPS was telling us where to go and the road we had to turn on was called what was it called <laughs> Cracker Crossing Cracker Crossing you had to turn on Cracker Crossing to get to Cracker Barrel <laughs> Oh my goodness. And you thought I was kidding. You didn't think that was the real name. That's what it said. Cracker Crossing. Alright guys, <laughs> we're still waiting on Juanita. Look, I want that barrel. It's even got the little hole there that you would think like a like a barrel for for like your beer your beer your beer paw or whatever it is. I don't know. I like the barrel. It's, I guess so, but I was just I don't need it for a keg. I don't drink that much beer. That would last me forever. I don't know, I just think it's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Look at this chair. It's it's been weathered. It's really been weathered. Hundred and eighty nine dollars. Holy crap! One. It's one hundred and eighty nine dollars. I went and wanted the black one, especially in Florida. You go out there and sit. And oh yeah, your butt will burn. But you wouldn't put these in the weather. You, you shouldn't. Under a porch. Under a porch. Yeah. That's There's right. Juanita. <laughs> so excited. She's here. You excited yeah. to finally meet Juanita? Yeah. Golly, girl, you're like a little, you're like a little kid. Well, go, go on. Ah. <laughs> Make sure it's her. <laughs> She's excited. She's really excited. <laughs> hey, woman. Here. You want me to pick it? Hey, girl. Hi. I'm How are you? I missed you too. Miss oh, don't cry. Oh, don't cry. Oh, you're going to make me cry. Then we're going to all be crying. Mama, don't you cry. look beautiful. It's Juanita, guys. Shout out to Juanita. <laughs> Henriette and I are going to have dinner okay, with her. Okay, guys. I am here tonight with Juanita and Henriette, the birthday girl. <laughs> And um, we're standing out here at the end of the hall at Cracker Girl outside. And we're doing TikToks. <laughs> and all of a sudden, these blinds go up. And while me and Juanita are doing a TikTok, this guy looks at Henriette and goes, <laughs> I want to go in there and ask if he'll make a TikTok with us. I'll do it. Oh, she's crazy. Yeah? 
Oh my goodness, we're having so much fun. We're making TikToks. Juanita's got a TikTok, guys. <laughs> First one. Yay, and we put two, video, vi 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 two videos on the earth. <laughs> so, where's the guy at? Is he coming out here? Having fun and looking like a fool. <laughs> we're not looking like a fool, we're having fun. That's all that matters. Yes, if we you are. laugh and giggle about it, yeah. it, that's all that matters. Who cares what anybody else thinks, right? Henrietta's yes, having a wonderful birthday. <laughs> right. <laughs> Happy birthday! Thank Happy you. birthday! Silly girl, did you find us a TikTok for all of us um, to do? I don't know. Okay, Are so be sure to check out our TikToks, guys. <laughs> okay, guys, say goodbye to Juanita. Bye. We are. We, Have a we nice like. Night. We like stayed here so long that the Cracker Barrel closed. <laughs> yes, it did. I love you. I love you too. And there's Henriette. Happy birthday. Thank you. Say goodbye. Bye. Hey, you know what we forgot to do? What? We forgot to show our presents. Get our presents. Oh. We're going to show our presents you. really quick. It's our birthday. It's Henriette's birthday, and then Juanita got me something for my birthday. Actually, she brought me my Christmas present, too. Yes, yeah, so okay. Put them on the table. Then you can show them. Yeah. All right, so this is what we got. This was my Christmas present, right? No, that was your, your birthday. Oh, this, this was my birthday. This was your Christmas oh, from yeah, last that, year, but I didn't get to get it. She didn't get to give it to me because of the, I don't know, I don't know. I think I, I was sick right before Christmas. Yeah. I don't know what happened, but she didn't get to give it to me. That was my Christmas present from last year. And there's my birthday present. And then she got me a card. She even gave me money. Thank you so much, Juanita. And then Henriette got nail polish. <laughs> And per is it perfume and lotions? Okay. And